Hello everybody and welcome to my e-lesson. I'm your guru and in this video I will tell you how you can protect your data in Excel by locking it through a password. It's very very simple. I'll show you an example. Now this is a sheet where I have entered a lot of data. For example, huh? there's not much of a data over here and I don't want anyone to make changes to it. Like, see if anybody tries to enter anything, you get a message that the cell or chart you're trying to change is on a protected sheet. Now to make any kind of changes over here, somebody would have to unprotect it. So that means I have already protected it. Now how did I do it? So that's very simple to do. It can be done in a few simple steps. So let me first unprotect it. So I go to the review tab, click on unprotect sheet and I applied the password one, two, three. So this is how you unprotect it. Now, how do you protect it? You go to the review tab and you see this option protect sheet. As soon as you get this option, you don't need to bother with anything else. Simply go ahead and select a password of your choice. Like I selected one, two, three in this case, it will ask you to re-enter your password, which is again one, two, three. As soon as you enter your password, this icon changes to unprotect sheet. Now nobody can go ahead and make a change whatsoever. All right. Now this is so very simple to do. Now there is a next level to it. Now in case you want that everything should be locked except a few cells like over here. Now say for example, instead of Rambo, I want to write Superman. I was able to do this, but I cannot write Superman here or here now how was i able to do that now that's called selective locking and to do that we will first have to unprotect the sheet one two three the sheet is unprotected go to the home tab now select those cells which you want to keep editable even after locking the rest of the sheet so i have selected these cells i want this section to be editable even after i have locked the sheet so now i will go to this click on the small arrow on this font tab and go to the protection option over here i will uncheck this logged icon and click ok now i'll go to review tab again and protect my sheet one two three one two three now the sheet is protected right all right but if I want to type something over here, uh, instead of Superman, my new choice is now say uh, Spider-Man. Black Widow, Supergirl. Dr. Dang is a, is a famous Indian villain. So let, let's have some famous Western villain. Give me a name. But whenever you find that name, type it over here. Balwan Thrai again is a famous Indian villain. And you can choose to have your own Western villain typed over here. Say, let's say, Dr. Octo. All right. Mugambo again is a famous Indian villain. And we can have our Western villain again over here. Who do we have? Thor. Thor is a superhero. And we can have... Iron Man over here and uh, instead of a villain we can have a hero which, which hero would that be that can be the new one Ant-Man and then we can have the new guy in town Deadpool <laughs> so this is how you do it I hope you like this video so until the next video go ahead to myelesson.org, download this file for practice and keep on practicing it and watch the other videos that are there. So until the next video, this is your guru now signing off for the day. Have a wonderful day ahead. Happy learning. Hello everybody and welcome to my e-lesson. I'm your guru and in this video, I'll tell you how to break the password of an Excel file within two minutes with no softwares and this is 100% free. So let's use this file for example. This is a currently unprotected file. We can type anything over here, right? Right. So I'm editing, deleting, whatever. Now I'm going to protect it in front of you. So I'm going to review. I'm going to protect the sheet. I'm entering the password one, two, three. It will ask me to re-enter it. One, two, three. I've entered the password. 
now it says unprotect sheet that means the sheet is protected what, whatever i try to do it will not allow me to enter anything over here now i'm going to close this file now i'm trying to open it it doesn't allow me i close it again now what i'm going to do is i'm going to first to the view options in windows 10 and check on this file name extension and if you're using an older version of windows then over here you'll find an option called organize in that in the security section you'll find this option of file name extension so what it does is it shows the file name extension over here itself i uncheck it and this is how you would see it if i check it this is how you will see it so you see the file extension i rename it I rename it to RAR, WinRAR, the same RAR. All right, I click yes. I click open and I go to the Excel folder over here. I go to the worksheets folder and over here there is this sheet, sheet one. That is what I want to edit. I extract it. I open it with a notepad. I find the password over here, you see password. Now, this is not the password. We had entered 123. So, this is CF7A. We don't need to find the password. We simply need to open the sheet. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to select this password and delete it and save the file. Now, I'm going to copy this file back to the RAR file. It will override it. Okay. I will delete it. I will again rename this file to xlsx, what it was, say yes, open the file, go to review tab, click on unprotect sheet, see it has not asked me for a password and it is open. Amazing, isn't it? Extremely simple within two minutes, nothing required. I hope you liked this video. Well, go ahead if you, if you liked it, do share it, comment on it and Wait for my next video. Until then, this is your Guru signing off for the day. Have a wonderful day ahead. Happy learning.